do this every time I record, I'm going to be doing a BoxyCharm unboxing. And this is the <clears throat> July BoxyCharm box. So let's just get right in here. I haven't even opened it yet. So let's get in and check it out. All right. So of course it comes with the handy dandy little card. I've been super happy with BoxyCharm so far, and I've only had it for a few months now, so I'm always excited to see what's in here. So this is the card that it's coming with today. So we'll just go down the line and see what we were sent. Okay. Oh, this is cool. So this is by Dr. Brandt. It's called No More, no More Baggage, and um, it's to get rid of the bags and puffiness underneath your eyes. I'm I'm actually, it's normally $42, $42. Oh my God, my nose ring just almost ripped out. $42, holy crap, that's ridiculous. This is this small. This better be like the most amazing eye depuffing gel ever. How do you even use it? You are guaranteed visibly reduced under eye bags and dark circles. Hmm, I don't feel like I have like bags under my, or puffiness under my eyes. I feel like if anything, I have like, see when I turn a certain way, I feel like there's a little bit of a dark circle under my eyes, so this would be interesting to see. I wonder if it just, like, firms your skin. If you've used this before, let me know, but I'm definitely, I'm going to try this. I don't use alone or under makeup. Let dry in between applications. Reapply as needed. Okay. So, you know what? I'll probably do this on my next Get Ready With Me. I'll just put it on beforehand. That'll be an easy Get Ready With Me to do to be able to try it out. So, that's cool. That's $42 normally. So, basically, already... You've just, with that one product, saved yourself money um, just by buying the BoxyCharm. Okay, so the next one is a Crown Brush, um, their Fuego Eyeshadow Collection. So, and this is normally $29.99. Let's see what this looks like. This is on the very bottom of the box, so. Oh, my nail just popped off. Dang it. Why does this always happen? Okay, I'm going to have a missing nail for the rest of this video because I don't feel like putting it back together right now okay I'm actually glad they sent it in this bubble wrap because I feel like sometimes companies don't do enough wrapping on their eyeshadow palettes and then you end up with broken eyeshadow okay so let's go ahead and pull this out and see I okay or not <laughs> I can't get it open why why okay there we go okay so that's what it looks like. Oh, oh my God. I seriously just talked crap about that and I got a broken eyeshadow palette. Sad face, that looked like a really pretty color too. Wow. These are big pans though. Look at the size of that pan, of those pans. Like I almost feel like, wow, what color, what did that color look like? Oh my God, that's such a pretty color. I know. That's the color that broke. I'll have to pour some alcohol in there and see if I can fix it. But in the meantime, I mean super pretty. These are not colors though that I don't already have. That's a pretty color. Just to kind of, that'd be a nice highlight. Let's see what this color looks like. Ooh, ooh, that's pretty. Let's see a matte. I just, I literally just went for every single shimmer on there. That's a matte. That's not a bad matte. What about this one? This is a lighter matte. That's pretty too. That's pretty. I'm I'm upset. It's broken. I will see if I can fix it before I do a get ready with me. This is super. The only thing I could say about this is it's definitely a super. I mean, obviously it's their Fuego collection. Fuego, fire, hot, warm, warm tone. So, um. So, I, I mean, I can definitely make a look out of it, and I love warm tone eyeshadow anyways, but I have so many of the same color, so not something that I would probably, like, purchase on its own unless I already did not have palettes that look like that. But I still like getting eyeshadow palettes, especially from other companies like this, to try. Um, it, that's the one thing I will say that I like about getting... Um, subscription boxes in, I think it opens my mind up to trying new products. So instead of all the same, you know, 
you know, 10 big companies that are out there, it's nice to just be able to try a new company. So I will try to fix that. I can't make any guarantees because I'm not the best at fixing broken eyeshadow, but I will attempt because that was a pretty color. So that's normally $29.99. So see, even with buy, even with that, you, this is already a smoking deal. Okay, let me see here. This is by Wander Beauty, and this is Unlashed Volume and Curl Mascara. Oh, this I thought this was a lip. How funny, it literally looks like a lipstick, doesn't it? I, I thought this was gonna be a lipstick. This is cool. Okay, intensely glossy mascara will bring your lashes to new heights. It conditions your lashes also. I wonder if it's waterproof. I've been wanting more waterproof. It doesn't say, so I'm assuming not. Let's see what this looks, this is cool that it's in this kind of container. Oh, look at the curve on that. All right. Ooh, and the bristles look like really soft. I can't wait to try that. Okay, I'm gonna put that down. That's normally $24, so that's ex God. I I know I'm just not a mascara person and that's why, but I seriously, like, $24 for a mascara? I mean, I think, I just can't imagine spending that much on mascara, but whatever. Okay, so now the next one is by Note Cosmetics. And all of these I've, I've heard of, obviously, Dr. Brat, Brandt and Crown Brush, but I have not heard of Wander Beauty um, or Note Cosmetics. So this is cool that I'm getting that. So this is, this is, says it's designed to work for all skin types, adds a natural color to your cheeks while preventing dryness. I could use that. There's a built-in brush and mirror. Okay, cool. Let's open it and see. Let's see what it looks like. Let's see what color they send me. I could pretty much make any color blush work anyways, just depending on the look I'm doing, but this is called Desert Rose. It's a little like orangey for me, but uh, not bad. I mean, I think, yeah, it's pretty orangey. Look at that. That's pretty warm, but it might look super good on my skin tone, so. I'm willing to give it a try. Actually, it doesn't look quite so orangey on my arm as it does in the container. Let me see what the brush looks like. Where is the brush? Oh, okay, so this flips up and then the brush is down here. I will probably never use this brush because I am a freak about my brush and I have a specific blush brush that I like and I don't like those little tiny ones. I don't feel like they blend enough, but it's cool that it has that. If you go somewhere and you're just really quickly want to grab it, it's cool that there's some sort of brush in there just to kind of help, just in case. So that's normally $11.99. So that's actually not bad for a blush, I think. I mean, obviously you can get blush for way, and way less expensive, but if you're into supporting smaller brands, um, this is actually not a, bra a bad, bleh, a bad, this is not a bad price. <laughs> Anyways, okay, so this is, and I hope I'm not saying it wrong, Chella Beauty, Chella, okay, C-H-E-L-L-A, so Chella Beauty, and I have not heard of them either, and this is normally, I cannot, $26, this is an eyebrow cream, um, creamy consistency and built-in brush, velvety formula makes blending easily, then sets giving you perfect brows that will last all day and night, let me see what this looks like. Okay, what? Oh, okay, so this doesn't come out? Like, so what do you do? What, how do you, does this bottom part come off? Oh, oh, okay, this is weird. Okay, so this just is on the bottom. I wish that, does it say directions? So I'll say the only thing that they're missing off this is a direction because I'm thinking when I pull this cap off, you know those twisty lip glosses? Sorry, my phone just said low battery. You know those twisty lip glosses that you just like keep twisting the bottom part and stuff slowly starts coming out? That's what I thought was gonna happen with this, but actually you untwist it, woo, the opposite direction and then there's eyebrow gel in there. So then there's a the little brush, or I can drop everything. Jesus, hold on. Okay, so there's the little brush and then what you're supposed to do is dip the brush into here and it's basically like a pomade. I don't I don't love that, honestly, but they sent me the right color, so I'll try it. But I don't love this because I can't tell how much is coming on. So, but I'll try it because this brush is actually a nice brush. 
we'll see watch it's gonna be like the best product ever still the $26 for it I mean if it's amazing I, I would pay $26 for it but if it's just okay I'll be this is weird this is supposed to be taupe that doesn't even look like taupe that looks like a medium brown or even maybe even a little darker depending on how much you put on but this is taupe well I'm glad that they sent me that color but I feel bad for anybody else that would normally use taupe because that is dark hmm okay Okay, so that's it that was in here. Like I said, I mean, I'm still impressed. Like the eyeshadow palette, of course, like it's just another eyeshadow palette and it's a warm tone one. For me, it's cool because I like to get new eyeshadow palettes just to see. I'm interested to see the eyebrow gel and the mascara. I'm interested to see that. The blush I can definitely use and I want to, I want to try out this Dr. Brandt. So I still feel like I'm going to keep my subscription. I still feel like it's, I feel like it's doing good. So that's going to be it for July's Boxy Charm. And I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope I get it out to you before everybody else, you know, already has their videos out and you just don't want to see my opinion anymore. I know how well that works. But I, for some reason, they just haven't been giving me my box very early. I feel like they need to send it to me earlier. But, you know, they're probably not going to listen to me on that. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to let you guys go now. If you haven't already, like and subscribe. And of course, go check out some of my other videos. And I'm also going to do another recording today because I got my Ricky's Colt Crushes. This will be my second month for my Ricky's Colt Crush box. So I'm excited to see what's in that. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye.